recording MIDI automation to a plugin in Pro Tools is pretty easy. The first thing to do is to make sure that your plugin is responding correctly to your external MIDI controller. And I usually do that by just moving some of the faders that I assigned to the controls in Sonic Synth 2. You can see the pan knob is moving around. It's responding. And so it should be all set. The next thing I do is record my MIDI song. Once you're done with that, you're going to press the MIDI merge mode button here. And then you're just going to record right over it with your automation. Now I'll play it back to make sure that it worked correctly, that it recorded my uh, automation. Cool, so it's playing back my automated pan. And um, of course, in Sonic Synth 2, it's really easy to set up any of these controls with your MIDI controller by pressing this MIDI control button and then left clicking on any of these knobs here. So for example, this one here opens up the window and I'll just click on this controller number and move the mouse up or down to control which number it's going to be on. And then of course, I, I've already got all that set up. As you can see, it's moving all those knobs that I assigned. And that's it.